Oh my gosh, these are my favorite. Consume last, the struggle to take in new information. If you are consume last automatically, you are doubling up on blast. So a lot of them are more known for the blast side of yourself. Right. So consume is just taking in new things for the self. Right. So you're like, it's an introverted one. So like sleep, consume, or yeah. these are the more introverted animals. And this one is just taking in, learning more. And if you're doubling up on blast, you're going to be more interested in teaching, talking, sharing, not taking in a very whole true. lot. Very true. Oh, very true. <laughs> you're going to go to Google last. Like, I don't know how else to explain it. Like, you're not going to want to pull in some kind of new information. You're like, how can I just bang things together or bother that guy in order to solve a problem? You know, like, that's kind of what you guys seem to be doing consistently. You it know? just feels like an overconfidence. They teach themselves and, you know, like that's kind of how you guys, like, your vibe first, is. I remember the first time I really saw him was like when we got into internet business, not to take over your show here and give a lesson. <laughs> but I remember specifically like when we, when the internet first started going at scale, like yeah. there were so many people that like so fast, their job was I make money online by teaching other people how to make money online. You're like, how are you getting away with that? And they're like 24 years old and like I make money online by telling other people how to make money online. You're like, so you just teach yeah. about and how like no shame, teach? no yeah, shame. Yeah, just I like, know. I just, That's so great. I just teach, uh, you know, videos. Right. I have videos on how to do videos. Because the value is on their ability to explain. Yeah. And teach. Yeah. Like the teaching side. That's what black. Oh, they'll be is. like a basketball coach and they don't even play basketball. Oh my God. Like somebody like me who's doubling up on consume. I'm like, no, 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 no. No, you have to have a product and there has to be depth there. You, you have to know everything. You, about the product that you have consumed for yourself for years before I would ever teach it. No, I got it. I'm like, no, no. I'm like, no, that's not, you're not done. Yeah. You don't get to like that's you know coming from me. I'm I'm doubling up on consume, doubling up on blast. Yeah. Anyways, okay. Oh, here so here, here's here's the you know the troublemakers. All right, so this is yeah. your category, which is weirdos. I don't need to stop and consume. I don't yeah. need to stop and take in. I just go over my own stuff. I'll figure it out as I go. And then I bang stuff together I'll to make check it work. Google once I have a specific problem I need to look up. After once, you've gone through all the other. <laughs> and blast and play has failed me, right? I'll do a quick search. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so you guys are funny, hilarious. These guys are pretty typical. The the two right Ty here. Ty Lopez style, yes. the, the Myers Briggs, yes. INTJs, INFJs. That yeah. is what they are known for. Just yeah. being like blasters, I will teach you, you don't even know. Yeah. I know all this stuff. Let me just it's such that, a one that's, way yeah. conversation. That's, that's how I define it. Those you are guys. the internet coaches that we would see. Yeah. 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 I'm a coach for coaches. Coach for the coach, sake yeah. of coaching, coach, yeah. coachy coacherton. Uh, and these guys right here are also super interesting because they have the lead oh, play. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, right? or, like, or especially this, the uh, the uh, consu the gather ones. The gather. The, Those the, are all gather. The play, blast, sleep. So the gather savior, they're still going to desire new, but they're going to do it through banging on other people's it's, heads. It's weird, yeah. Okay, so I have a clip of Ty Lopez. So Ty Lopez is known for, I read a book a day, yeah. right? Okay, so what is he actually doing? Lying. <laughs> You can't say that. <laughs> when he goes in, like this is, cause this is what I assumed was happening. I'm like, I know you're consumed last. What are you actually doing? And then I found a clip on, I'm like, oh my God. That's what I suspected, but it's so hilarious to hear somebody say, I go in to read a book looking for what I already wanted to see out of the book. Like right. I have my known information bag and I'm gonna go find it right. in this new book. Because he already blasts sleep plays and knows what he's looking for. Yes. He's building something, he's working on yes. something and he's just gotta get those last little missing pieces in there. Right. I'll give you the big picture because I hate when people save all the good stuff for later. <laughs> so the first thing is, what's my, <laughs> what's my reading ritual? I have three reading rituals, I read morning, lunch, afternoon, I set intervals. I like 15 minutes in each interval, that's 45 minutes. I have a timer. I have my book. In the mornings I read classic, The Soap of the Brain. At afternoon I use it to take a nap. I read a how-to business relative to my career or relative to my he health. You know, something that gives me a tangible. The morning classics are more big picture philosophy. I get technique. Then at night I read biographies to help me go to sleep and to give me courage. We'll talk more about that in a second or in the next videos. Then I have my timer on my iPhone. You can have any kind of timer, your Android or a real timer. I set it, I divide how many minutes I want to read per day. I, I like to read 45 minutes minimum a day. So I divide it in three intervals, 15 minutes a pop. I set that thing for 15 minutes. I've got this book, boom, I've got parameters. Now I, for one or two seconds, I think, what's the end game goal of reading this book? Okay, I was reading this book because I wanted, uh, you know, like 
management. I'm, I'm, I need that how to. I'm hiring a lot of people. So I go yeah, in. There you go. Right there. Right there. Yes, right there. He's yes, already deciding yes, beforehand. That. What am I looking for? Yes. And this is also ultimate peacock. I read a book a day. Really? What does that mean to you? A show off. Yes, Demons. Yeah. Right. It's, it's a weird thing. Oprah, right. say, Oprah, same thing. She's got a book club. Yeah, it's just like, no, stop, stop. <laughs> Like you ever like meet a real nerd like, yeah, my house is buried in books. It yeah. really sucks. Anyways, they're, yes. they're not showing it off. I know. This yeah. feels like he's going down like a mine shaft. He's like, all right, so I'm about to read a book. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to bolt on 15 minutes yes. here, 15 minutes here. Yes. I got my jacket on. What am I looking for? Let's make this quick. All right, so I'm about to yes. open it up. Uh... Tension and I go, I'll be good to just get one nugget. This guy, Jack Welch, built a company added $400 billion in net worth to the market cap of GE. Teaching. I'm not gonna learn everything this guy learned in 40 years. Build oh, that's a good reason to not read the whole thing. I just need one you nugget. Can't, you just need- <laughs> Just gotta go in and get that one nugget. Get in and get the hell out of here. <laughs> As he's a young multimillionaire, by the way. I know. Like, uh, yeah, figure like, that out. We can make fun of him all we want. What he is doing is working oh for God. him. And that's that's the thing that like that's this like savior syndrome. We're like, wait a minute. I know. Yeah, it actually works out for us. Like, yeah, my savers, that works great. He's got this whole little racket. I do this and I'm like, what's the problem? Totally. I have Here we go. <laughs> I recognize this. So here's some shears. I got the same shears. Yeah, we do. And they broke, which they should, because they were just made horribly. It's just horrible design. And they were in parts. The two handles fell off. Yes. The, the, the wood came off from the metal. Just right, just Just completely just fell like apart. Yep. My thinking is, what, it's like probably 12 to 14 bucks. Just go buy a new one. You're already going to go to Home Depot later today. Why not just go gather a new one? It's not that big of a deal. And like, that is not how you think. So I'm just sitting here watching, Joan. This is so yeah. crazy and hilarious, but like, okay, let's go. So we go and he's like, I'm gonna Gorilla Glue them together. Cause oh, that, it go expands. Ahead. I've done those kind of joints before. I've done this before. Oh you yeah, know, the, the, that's in my new the information. The wood and metal, I know that the Gorilla Glue will expand and hold that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I have consumed that. So played that actually. Let's go ahead and see if we have Gorilla Glue. Oh, we do. It's like a four year old bottle. Uh, what are we gonna do? L no, let's just go buy some more glue. In the middle of that glue there could be some wet oh glue around all the dry glue just like so i let's have cut to, it open this is play blast yeah. like no i refuse to go gather right. new i won't right. just go buy some new glue it's, it's like like for me it's just like this mat is like a lot of it was yes the consume last but from my <laughs> side what i'm feeling is like the masculine and the and the oh the, yeah the self of like fuck you. Right? I am not gonna go to fucking Home Depot <laughs> I know. and play consume. Go look through the glue. Guess what? I know. Now they have a new brand. Right, that's I'm what like, you're no. avoiding. No new. No, no they new. changed it. It's right. new. I, oh, fuck. <laughs> Hell no. I will <laughs> dig down to the fossil record to get the last little bit of Gorilla Glue. <laughs> Cut it open. There was a teeny, yeah, it was so like. And it worked. I had just enough, too. Yeah. <laughs> Digging it and out. And if I did, I would have just thrown these in Gary's yard. 